Hello, planet Earth. I'm Eva Tyson, one of the 230 scientists and engineers stationed up here on the Pilgrim. Regular viewers of this live feed will notice I am not in my traditional t-shirt and socks. I am in a spacesuit, and that is because today I am going home. And joining me on that homeward flight is one of my colleagues, Dr. Grant Moon. Hi. It's actually pretty incredible because we've both been aboard the Pilgrim for three months, but because there are so many people up here studying the anomaly, this is actually the first time that Dr. Tyson and I have met. So, hello, Dr. Tyson. Oh, hello, Dr. Moon. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure it goes without saying. I'm a specialist in a branch that applies the laws of physics and chemistry to analyze the genesis and demise of various nebulae in the universe. Observable objects, atomic particles, all the way up. Pretty much anything on the candela and thermodynamic temperature scales. It includes aspects of astronomy and cosmology as well, but it's actually more complex than that, so... He's a star expert. <laughs> yeah, you know, using that would save a lot of space on my resume. <laughs> it really would. And for those of you who are new to this, our ship is here to analyze a very special wave of radiation. We're all here just for that. Now, the universe is full of solar radiation, but what makes this radiation so special is that it has no discernible source. Masses of energy pouring into the universe from nowhere. So you can see why we're all so fascinated by it. Limitless energy, forever. Now, if we look out the window, you should be able to see the shuttle that's coming to pick us up. The Wanderer, named after the poem. Wanderer returns. And if we link to the pilot's POV camera, you'll get a good view of the entire station, as well as the radiation anomaly behind us. And if we're lucky, we should just be able to see the Big Dipper off to the side, too. Here we go. Whoa! <laughs> Wanderer, this is Pilgrim. We're ready for you in the airlock. Please activate your auto-docking sequence. Roger that, Pilgrim. This is Wanderer. Auto-docking sequence engaged. Thank you, Wanderer. You're looking good. Uh, Wanderer, we're having some difficulty syncing with your docking gear. Guiding system will take care of your side, but I think we're going to need a second over here. Roger that, Pilgrim. Waiting on you. That's it. Keep it coming. Wait, wait. I think it's still not working. We're going to try a manual reboot. Stand by. Still nothing. Command, any different on your end? <laughs> oh my god, this is awesome. No, no, it's not a big deal. Wanderer, we're in our EMU suits. We can just open the airlock manually and boost over to you. Oh, that's why I can't see because it's Jupiter. This is by the book. Look, we have a crap, that's huge. And that is beautiful, and that is awesome, and I'm loving it. Ba da ba ba ba. That's cool though. That is not a useful question here. I I just I really really like this. Look, I have legs. Oh my God. You never have legs in VR games. Roger, holding position. Whoa. Is that supposed to be like my neck? Okay. I'm opening the outer hatch. Tethers are attached. Looking good. So your name? It's uh seriously Dr. Moon. Yeah. But for all the playground teams. Where I am right now. God. Look at it. Sixty yards out. Oh. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. The hell is that? Pilgrim, this is Eva. Are you seeing this? Fuck five. It's on. Pilgrim, this is Eva. Are you seeing this? Oh my god. Pilgrim, do you copy? Do you see this? We gotta move. What is it doing? 
Everybody in that segment right there is dead. Everybody over there is probably also dead. Yeah. in my eyes. What? Look at that shadow! Oh my god! I have a shadow! And it goes into the back. What? This game is... I'm sorry, but... Look, look at that! Look at this! I mean, it's kind of glitched out a bit because of the chair and all that, you know? As you can very clearly tell, but... Who cares? I have a shadow man. Oh. Brace for impact. Oh. Now I'm standing. What does that say? I locked. Well, okay then. Just my fan here a little bit behind me, so that way it gets air to the Cast. Location report. Now. In so I am hollow. 23% nitrogen, 2% oxygen, 12% helium. Warning, 63%. There's my camera. Elements. Use the highlighter stick to move forward. Oh, ah. Oh. Pilgrim, this is Wander. Come back. It's because I accidentally clicked again. my this is thing as left. Actual. As uh, left. Left-handed. I'm not actually left-handed. I'm right-handed. But you know what? It's not like it truly matters. That thing's going to be there the whole time. That's going to be kind of annoying. Oh. Fuck me. Say that this does have some pretty good graphics. I mean, look, look, where? Assault rifle. The UEP assault rifle is the standard issue rifle for UEP personnel. It provides a high rate of fire and unlimited ammo, but can overheat. Keep an eye on the integrated heat cage. 
heat gauge. Ah! I wonder what this is, though. Dr. Moon, Dr. Tyson, this is Wanderer. You copy? I feel like I'm, like, scanning, just like, like on a, you know, like this. But like, I'm scanning for this, just... Mm, I feel like Eve from Wally. -E. Did it. Did it. Oh my. Oh my. Probably should back up here. Did it. <laughs> Go fast. Oh my. This is pretty stunning, I'm not gonna lie. This this little game looks pretty amazing. Look Look at that. <laughs> no, but really, like just like wow. Acting just like Real clouds disappearing, like, holy crap. I think a lot of work went into this game. Everything has shadows. If anything, this is going to turn into, like, a game review just off of the design and of everything. Like... Like, I mean, obviously, you gotta take some cutbacks for rocks and stuff, because as you get cl closer, you know. Kind of does that, but that's mostly what rocks look like. Hold on. Looks like they're both dead. They're alive. Dr. Moon, Dr. Tyson, if you can hear this, stay where you are. I'll find you. Stop. That is water. Jump? Nope, but I'm able to crouch. That's a big sun. And that's awesome. Look look at that sun. Like, look how thin that is. And that is just... Mm. Well, that's... No, that's awesome. Just making sure I'm... On. Hello? Okay. Is someone there? I don't think I want to know. Did you see? Do you see that?
God. <laughs> no. That? Scared. Oh, that's disgusting. Looks kind of like you. Yes. Huh? Well, I'm just messing with you. If anything, looks like me. Kinda sucks I can't turn. All I can do is walk one direction. No, not that one direction. This direction. That's a crater. That would suck to fall. <gasps> no! Why? Do you have to jump? At my face! <laughs> this is even, this is worse than doom just but just because there's and only because of the reason that they're jumping at my face What is this? Did you hear that? Cass, make sure you log all this. Recording.
you know how much better? No, 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 I don't like that. I don't like that. No, 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 get away from me, Jeez, this game is going to give me like arachnophobia or something, <laughs> Jesus, move the controller over the ammo to pick it up, guided rocket, the UEP assault rifle has an integrated guided rocket launcher. Use okay. the targeting laser to guide the rockets to the designated target. You like my arm? The UEP assault rifle can hold a total of five guided rockets. Press the highlighted button to fire the secondary weapon. They're dead. I don't like that music. <gasps> Why are you jumping so far? That's the wind. What? Oh, so what was that? Okay, it's just a rock. I really don't like that sound. I'm sorry, but partial data recovery complete. New holographic files are available to view. Playback. All recovered files. Oh. Here we go. Viewing some files now. Oh. POV cam moon grant. Is it the pilgrim? No. No, but it's a piece of it. Broken off from the main station on entry. I guess we found our power source. Hello? Anyone inside? This lady's short. Come on. I mean, pretty. Shelby. Battery packs. We strip off the casings. We can use these to boost our signal. You prep him. <laughs> I'll patch him to the comms unit. Well, yours, Dr. Moon. Hey, something weird here. What? These batteries, they're all at 1% power. That's funny. 1% is enough for six months. Yeah, but why are they all depleted? Hello? That's a cool setup she got right there. Probably shit 
Why do I think, feel, that something's gonna, like, come down from above? Uh, that's just maybe me. Yeah, maybe I've seen too many space movies, but th that's, yeah. Mm -hmm. Pilgrim, if you can read us, we don't know our location. We're down to our last emergency rations, but we found a HAV unit. There are extra rations here to keep us going. We're alive. Are you? Please come back. Evie, you need to take a break. We've been going for an hour. Here. It's the last one for my suit. Some kind of strawberry goo. Sorry. <laughs> it's all right. That's it. Mm. When the pilgrim broke up on entry, it looked a trail of debris just like this, right? We found one piece because we're sitting in it. But if we can find the next few pieces. We can calculate the speed and trajectory of the station. We can figure out where the Pokemon crashed. So is this going to be like... Are you sure about this? Me trying to find them while they're doing whatever? Or... Are they going to die? Are we expecting company? That don't look very good. Okay, Eva. I'm right behind you. Dr. Tyson, if you can hear this, I'm following the trail of debris. Oh, that's gross. Did it get exploded as well? I hope. Oh! No! You like how I'm not even aiming? <laughs> it's because I don't want to. Oh, look at that! I got a trophy. That's disgusting. Well, there's some of, uh... There's some of the, what is it, the Pilgrim? I believe it's called? Oh, sorry I wasn't in the zone. I'm definitely gonna get like arach. So, yeah, I'm gonna have to put an arach. Nephobia warning, on this, for anybody who you know afraid of spiders. Obviously, you're not gonna want to see giant alien ones lobbing globs of poison goo at you or small little face xenomorph face hugger looking things. Literally jumping at your face. They're basically face huggers. I have one on my wall. I gotta say, those spaceships are always bigger than you think they are. 
Great, now I'm jumpy for everything. I mean, this is what, get, what happens when you play Doom and then, like, basically right after you play a game with alien spiders. Wait a minute, why am I back here? Oh, I went the complete wrong way, didn't I? Yep, I sure did. Whoa. The game decided it was going to completely turn me around. Well, yeah. on the road again. No, I just can't wait to get on the road again. What happens if I... Nope, nothing. Alert. Seismic activity detected. Yes. Suit status. That was totally Suit fake. Suit is stable. Alert. To assist holographic file recovery, please locate and scan all fragments. Put them up. This is a stick up. Could be handy. Stack it up and I'll mark the coordinates. You're dead. Give me all your money, boo. Switch weapons. Reload. What is this? How much bigger do these things get? <laughs> Look at the, the, the uh. Oh, let me guess, let me guess. They're going to get like massive. Like th this whole thing is going to turn into one. Like, come on. Whoa, those things can really fling themselves. Oh, I don't have any grenades with the grenade launcher. Alert. Environment temperature increasing. Cooling system engaged. That is some weird looking lava. That's awesome. Oh my god, they got lights. Shafts and every oh my god. This game is like, oh, oh no. Ha! 
launcher. The UEP tactical shotgun has an integrated grenade launcher. The high explosive grenades explode three seconds after being fired or instantly if they hit an enemy. The UEP tactical shotgun can hold a total of 10 grenades. That thing is horrifying. Oh, wow. No, 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 no. 